you're watching the most important part of your entire day. You're watching Del Marva Live, and Corey is going to take us on an adventure. Jimmy, that adventure is in beautiful Berlin. Business is back, and the folks of the town are hoping you can make it boom. We'd like to introduce to you Berlin's Director of Economic and Community Development, Ivy Wells. Ivy, how are you? I'm good. How are you? I'm good. Thank you so much for joining us via Zoom today. Sure. So there's a lot of exciting stuff happening in Berlin, right? Uh, there's always something exciting happening in Berlin. So what kind of uh, what kind of events are we looking forward to? Well, I wouldn't necessarily call them events because we're not to that stage yet. However, our business community, they've been working together and the locals have been coming out to support our businesses even while they were closed. Uh, tonight at 5 o'clock, we're allowed to be able to eat outside amongst ourselves. We've opened up the property on the Calvin B. Taylor Museum. It's a beautiful piece of property for people to be able to come down and bring chairs and picnic, obviously following social distancing rules. Did Ivy, did you ever think that we would get to a point in time where we could actually be excited, you know, about something as small as eating outside with friends? I, I know. It's like that scene in The Wizard of Oz when the house lands and Dorothy opens the door and everything's in color and it's come out, come out wherever you are. So that's how we feel tonight. That's very cool. Now, Sunday, I know there's a farmer's market happening, right? Yeah, we have a farmer's market every Sunday from 9 a.m. to 1 p.m. It, I truly believe in farmer's markets. I wish we could have one every day. I wish everyone could get their food from our local farmers. But this farmer's market has really blown up over the last few weeks with the demand for local produce and meat and seafood that our businesses actually open up on Sunday mornings at 9 a.m. because the, the people are so thirsty for, for just seeing other humans walking around. It's really important to support our, lo our local farmers and also just, just to get outside and, and enjoy the fresh air. And if people have never tried locally grown produce, it tastes so much better than anything else you've ever had. You it, have to try it. it. <laughs> you, you know, I, I did a taste test for, for a group of my friends with some strawberries, and I did star, store bought, and I did local strawberries, and it, it's an incredible difference. And you know where your food is coming from. You actually get to meet the farmers. We are a producers only market. So everything that you see there is grown right here locally on Del Marva. How is it that you can set this up in a safe way? We've been following the CDC guidelines and also I'm in contact with the Maryland Department of Agriculture on a weekly basis, letting them know how things are going because they're interested as well. And we, we have our booths at least six feet apart. We have hand sanitizing state. We have hand sanitizing stations set up. Uh, we had to expand it. It's now on two streets and people do follow the protocol of, of social distancing and where you have to wear a mask. Masks are required at all times. Okay. All right. That makes sense. So other shops are open as well too. Like we've, we mentioned restaurants and farmers markets, but shops are starting to open up a little bit as well. Oh, right. The, the shops are opening now at 9 a.m. and many of them are actually bringing tables outside. So people don't, if people, you know, obviously people are still a little scared and they're nervous. So the, the best thing that we can do as a community is to make people feel comfortable. So by you wearing a mask and everyone else is wearing a mask, it shows that we care about you and we want to make sure that your safety is the number one, uh, our number one goal. Sure, and, what, and, and all while supporting local business. I don't think a lot of people realize that some of these local business owners, you know, they're your neighbors, they're your friends, they're people that you see when you're out at the grocery store or walking their dog in your neighborhood, you know? So that's something that we should always support. Now, what is one message that you would like to get out to Delmarva? Our mantra is to shop and support local. The community is what matters. And we have this beautiful Berlin bubble here and everyone's invited and just support our local businesses and our farmers because we're not a commuting town. Everyone who works here lives here and plays here. So we're all in this together. All right. Berlin's Director of Economic and Community Development, Ivy Wells, thank you so much for joining us this afternoon. Thanks so much. Have a good weekend. Thank you. You too.